welcome to another episode of Quake. This is episode two of the double episodes. Just so you know which one came first and which one came second. They're going to be uploaded on the same day, same week, because we're doing two episodes. You get a bonus episode this week, simply because it's been so long since my computer was broken and since I got my new computer fixed, as I explained numerous times why I went through the trouble of building a whole new computer, because I basically had to replace half the thing, and I was like, you know what, I want a new case that has better dust filtration and has a full-size window. And then by the time I put in the new case, I was like, oh, I want a new graphics card, and I want this, and I want that. And I'm like, uh, I just built a whole new computer, didn't I? Yep, taking the hard drive out and building a whole new computer. Done. <laughs> anyway, uh, I do apologize if you can hear that goddamn fan. When the game noise kicks in, I cannot, but obviously. And let's do a little pause before the, before the lobby. The lobby. Okay, we're in now. We're in. That didn't take very long. Are we doing this? Oh, we've got to capture the flag going. Okay, it's going to be capture the flag. Everybody get ready for the capturing of a flag. Oh, yeah. My FPS is low now. As I said, I put this, I put it in a diff different corner because I want to see the FPS counter. And it is insert. It is getting like 200 FPS in this game. I have maxed the crap out of everything. So, and this is a really fast-paced game, so maxing the graphics should really make the thing struggle, which is exactly why I put it on there. I'm obviously not running into any issues. Uh, I already did a few benchmarks to make sure I wasn't going to run into any issues of any particular variety. Okay, let's do this. Oh, this is still a warm up. Okay. I love how I capture the flag like in single death match. You get ammo that's for every gun. Just to clarify, in Team Deathmatch... In Team Deathmatch, you get ammunition for specific guns, where in other game modes you get white ammunition, which is for every gun. So whatever gun you have equipped will have ammunition for it. Shit, he got a lucky shot in. How the hell did I fall off the damn map? I think I got some lag. I got a bit of lag. That's going to be a bit of a tricky. I'll work around it. How are you not dead, bro? You should be dead. God, I hate this map. What was I getting attacked by? Okay, got the flag, got the flag, go, 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 go. Ooh. 
Luckily, that guy, that was my guy, so he should have the flag. Okay, we're going to need to defend us up here. That's the move he does. He takes the flag and uses acid breath to make it harder to follow. What the hell? That guy gets a lot of lucky shots, shots, but there's no way he should be able to hit them at times. Come on! Attacked you for a million, dude. You should be dead. Okay, got this. Dumbass, if you do the same thing every time, I'm going to know what you do. I'm going to know what you're going to do, which means I know how to counter you because you did the same thing every time. Don't do the same thing every time and I would be able to predict your actions and movements. God damn it. How does that guy keep hitting me? How does anyone hit anything with that gun? Got this. Oh my god! I wish I had invulnerability! Yep, I should have invulnerability. Everyone else seems to have some nice invulnerability that they can exploit.
That guy is using Angot, and if I report him Angot, that means I should get in vulnerability and murder everyone. Ah. Okay. Well, that's been another episode of Let's Play Quake.